I'm about to take you on a short tour of my uh, steam engine collection. Um, here you see the first half of the collection, which is the, the mobiles, um, the station reserve on the other side of the room. First of all, we have the uh, Bowman 234 Loco, which is the, uh, the LNER version, number 4472. Uh, a bit of a joke because of the number of the flying Scotsman, probably about the only uh, similarity. Uh, next to that, we have the, uh, the Hornby uh, rocket. Um, and next down here, we have Midwest Fantail launch. Uh, sold us two kits one for the hull and one for the engine. Uh, and this one's been slightly modified by myself. Uh, and then down here we have this wonderful little pop-up boat. This one is made by Roman India Ratten Deep. Uh, great fun for the money. <laughs> uh, and here we have a uh, steam dray which started life as a Mammoth SW1 uh, chassis. Um, I bought it from eBay uh, just as a chassis in very rusty condition and rather than restore it to, uh, to its original condition I decided to uh, turn it into this uh, very nice little steam dray. Uh, and here we have the, uh, the classic T1, uh, probably the most popular uh, Mamad engine. Uh, next to that we have an actual SW1. Uh, this one's been converted to radio control, uh, which is what the, the box on the back is. All the electronics and is in there. Um, Next along we have uh, another classic, the uh, Baton Mammoth's first mobile, uh, the SR1, uh, this is the early version of the, uh, the old star wheels. Uh, down here we have the uh, Jubilee version of the, uh, the Loco, um, the SL6, uh, limited edition one. And then next we have an SA1, uh, the uh, steam automobile. Um, this is the uh, one with the latest star wheels. Uh, 